Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to my channel. I couldn't read that in time but it just said This game is very scary man, you're gonna be scared man. I don't think I have to do much explaining. Dark Fracture. Prologue is meant to be a complete a completed uh, completed in a single session. If we quit mid game all progress will be lost. Interesting. What if I do quit mid game? Am I gonna upload this? Of course I am. His broken mind leaked his fractured soul into a dark, endless labyrinth in the eternal night. He longed for respite from the loneliness, only to realize he had never really been alone. Nice. Game looks pretty interesting for now, I gotta say. From the intro to the sounds. Uh. <sighs> nice. How long was I out? Uh, I need a cigarette. Where's my damn lighter? I expected the game to be a little bit more ominous. I gotta say. Kinda did. You know, we're in an office. There's nothing ominous about that. I'm tired of modern horror games. I want something more medieval. I meant to... I meant Zentine. Personal medication, my psychiatrist tells me it is used for severe mental illness that do not improve. Illnesses that do not improve. I've been consuming these for several years now. Common side effects some experiencing are drowning, uh, drowsiness, low blood pressure. Low blood. Oh my god! Low blood pressure. Blurred vision and dizziness. And dizziness. Well, um, what, what medical illness though? Like what mental illness? Oh my god. Today I am really working on 2%. I don't get it. Theodore. He was left behind on a car in a cab seven years ago by a passenger before me. His enigmatic smile caught my eye. We have been best friends ever since. You're very autistic and you have schizophrenia. He does not say much but is a great listener. I always wonder what he's looking at. He's looking at your dumbass talking to him, bro. He's like... The fuck you talking about, bro? I'm a toy, man. What are you... Not even a toy. Like he's specimen report number three seven seven. Okay, I like this shit. I always assumed that working on a body farm research facility would be exciting. Turns out it's mostly filing reports and checking on dead bodies one after the other. That that sounds pretty interesting. Not gonna lie. Uh, Miss Mister Roberts was injected with twenty five millimeters of compound O two F N twelve. Prior to plantation, the procedure itself went smoothly. The subject had passed them of old age prior to being processed. The autopsy performed <laughs> prior to plantation. What plantation, though? Are we in the 1940s? Are these slaves? Um, so that specimen 37782 was missing a kidney. However, the latest autopsy, ought posy, I guess, Reports suggest that the missing organ was restored prior to the onset of early de de decomposition. Is that how you write it? Okay, maybe it's because I got it mixed up with Spanish. The body has begun to decompose after 30... Okay, what is going on? What is going on with bro? Can I read? Okay, I gotta read fast. I'm trying to read it for you, but... Uh, however... Prior to plantation showed this bit was missing a kidney. However, the latest autopsy reports... Uh, the body has begun to decompose 30 days out on location. Though the body was not protected by a cage, nor any form of chemical repellent, nor protection of any description. Over the past month, repeated examinations of the body were conducted and ordered as ordered the very first signs taking a month uh, to manifest and as of yet the process remains slow additionally no evidence have been found of any animal approaching the body even insects seem to give the area a wide birth well, very very well written there's some typos there uh, so we got we got we got and Forensic science. Body decom decomposition. I, I don't really know if it's, if it's decomposition. Oh yeah, it's locked. 
where I leave the key, man. Let me see where you leave the key, man. Just remember that I had locked the door and locked it before my nap, just in case someone came in and caught me off guard. I remember placing the key in one of the desk drawers before passing out. That's the office key. Where's my lighter? Now, where's my lighter? What are you talking? Oh, shit! Who that? James. It's probably his son. Let me get them cigarettes. Seriously, where's the lighter? That's some pills that I can't take for some reason. I don't know what happened before though. Okay. One of these drawers is gonna be closed. It's jammed. What's that? Get stuffed. Nice. It's probably expired. I'm looking for a fucking lighter. I don't want. I don't want to make this gameplay three thousand days long. All right. I'm a married man. I have to go back to my children. Okay, can't find anything. I'm gonna just get out of here. It's a little dark in here. Maybe I should turn the lights on. No, no, no. <laughs> Alright. How am I gonna turn the lights on? I can't see shit. Uh, I might have walked a bit too much with no light. Oh, I'm lost. I'm actually lost. Oh, is this... Where am I? Oh shit! Damn! That's so much... That's so different from what I expected. Am I gonna get chased? I hate getting chased. You know, these indie... Uh, well, these... This is not an indie game. Indie horror games do scare me. Well, they don't. They don't scare me at all because they're predictable. And there's nothing really chasing you, really... Something that feels alive. But when a game has an enemy that actually chases you around, I, I, I think that's a lot more scary than anything else. But, I mean, you ultimately, you know that I I actually can't get, get scared. You know what I mean? Today I'm very stuttery. I don't know why. I'm lagging. Very low FPS in my, my brain. The key to my locker. It's old and rusty. I've always wondered how many people have held it before me. Locker. I'm gonna slide it on my office keychain. Jane Doe was injected with the cum of compound, alright? Uh, prior to plantation, three months ago, the body was un unidentified. The woman is woman, alright? Was recovered from nearby. Ah! The body had severe lacerations and was, and was missing an arm. Let's go. Though the reason behind the body's condition was never discovered, the body was discovered in. Okay, whoever wrote this is not very good at that. In remarkable shape. What is remarkable shape? Like she was she was kind of fine or what? At the, late, at the latest checkup. Over the last six months, one of the... Uh, six months of the observation. Oh my god! Uh, uh, an autopsy is performed thus far. The body has undergone the early stages of decomp uh, decomposition early on. 
However, the skin and limbs have been uh, woolly. The fuck is woolly repaired? Already? Holy. I don't know. Uh, no, the body seems to have. No, from where it was found. It seems to have removed. No, moved three centimeters north from where it was first planted. <laughs> Though there, there is no evidence of tempering tampering from neither animals or employees nor had, nor had nor had there been any natural phenomenon that could have pushed the body i don't i don't some of it is not you know it's blurry autopsy room i got no business going there this is the worst locker room i've ever seen in my life open other people's lockers Smart and clean, of course. I really feel like I can't trust this game. Kind of. Home sweet home. I gotta get my lighter, bro. Go home, man. The fuck you mean? Oh crap! I almost forgot about the pill. Take the pill. They're watching. Who is watching? I need to take my oxen tools and light it pill from my locker. It is a small shady looking red and white capsule. I've got plenty more upstairs. Not that I ever want any more of these. I need to consume them daily if I want to continue working here. Part of the rule book. Facility medication, the administration here requires all staff to consume this pill daily. With strictly specific directions saying that they claim the pill is for staying mentally alert on the job and the daily ritual. Center centers our thoughts and focuses the mind or something like that. Well, I better do it the way they asked. There's I'm pretty sure cameras around. It feels like they're watching my every move. I'm pretty sure it's because they're goddamn uh ghosts here. Matter of fact, one of those ghosts is taking a very fat shit here. Can't see myself, obviously. Not because the mirrors were broken, it's just because in this universe, God is too lazy to make reflections, I guess. He didn't invent, he didn't invent them. Look at that, I'm invisible. You can consume your daily pill by opening your inventory and using the pill. Didn't I already consume it? <laughs> Many random paranormal events will occur throughout the dark fracture let's go your sanity will be strained by such events your actions will also affect your sanity try try to persevere persevere okay this is not very well, very well written persevere it to get through the game push it too low and you may not make it good lord okay got this okay. can finally head to the store for a smoke okay i got forced to take a shit now i guess it closed by itself i've done this as i was told Bravo being the administrator's instructions is the only way I can work, continue working here. I've learned of, uh, of a few blind spots though, where I get to catch a break from their incessant prying. I usually smoke in the aisles in the aisles of the storeroom. I got a secret spot here with a step stool and an ashtray I always leave behind. It is one of the only places out of view with the cameras and I can always chill while smoking here. All right. Why did the door close? So it closed by itself. Alright, that's cool. I thought my character closed it. Is this the place where I catch a break? With a step stool and an ashtray. I don't know where it is though. Is it around here? Why don't I leave the place? Isn't it like past work time? Because I'm the only one in the facility. Why am I? Why am I still here? Just because I want to smoke? Wait. What the hell are my cigarettes? Oh, they're back in the office. You stupid asshole. Seriously. Cigarettes. What's this? Valve handle. I don't remember it ever being here. 
Wow. I picked it up. Mister, I, I picked up the goddamn thing, man. My fucking skull with the hell with the light bulb. He hit me with the goddamn light bulb, like as if we're in a bar fight or something. <laughs> the fuck did I do to you, bro? It's the phone in the office. Damn! Call. That's a violent dump, man. Gotta relax in there. Anyway, we're going back home. To the office. I'm carrying this valve with me. Because I am a man of the valve. You know. Half-life and that. It's not available during the demo. Shit. Missed the call. I should probably get back to work. Bro, you're the you're the stupidest man I know. Mr. Cole should get back to work. I wanna smoke, I wanna shit, I wanna jerk off. Damn, I missed the phone call. Might have been important and someone is probably gonna come in and check on me. I'd better get busy. From what I recall, there are six bodies occupying the freezers in the freezer room. The routine checkup is in order. I still got a few more hours to spend down here until my shift ends. But when I'm done, should also check on the decomposition. It's not, it's not how it's written. Process in the outdoor cages. All right, sir. Mm. <laughs> it's time for the routine chip. You're not good at singing, woman. Seriously, you're not good. Just stop. I don't like that shit. Alright, can I use the lighter to light up? Shit, I don't like this. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, what is that? What's the outside? What I would call the woods. Door to the facility upstairs. I need to finish the shift. Bro, you you work at the worst place I've ever seen. My God. Fucking checking up on dead motherfuckers, bro. So there's six beds here. Am I going to have to bring these motherfuckers here? It's all right. I'm the man for the job. Don't worry about that. I was born for this. I swear to God. I swear to God I was. I promise, man. Other than that, miss you too. What? I miss you? Okay, so I don't really know I'm supposed to be going with that. Get busy. There are six bodies occupying the freezers in the freezer room. Which is where? I don't know where it's at. Where the freezer room at? Might be this. Yeah! I have to move both crawlies out of the room. Oh shit. Okay, now for the second trolley. Oh shit. I don't know if I'm gonna get chased. But good lord, if I do. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll be in trouble. Now that this is done, I can go check the occupied freezers. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So, which one am I looking for? It wasn't too hard. Freezers A3. A3, which is this. What am I supposed to do? Should all be occupied. I want to. Oh. 
A5. He's in there. B8. The music stopped, by the way, so you better get... You better get ready, boss. What? My lighter ran out. Nice. It's about to get even more fun, boys. A ghost just sucked my lighter clean. Well, not clean, dry. It needs to be refueled every now and then, so I should only use it when I have to. Where am I gonna get where am I gonna get it from? Alright, that's gonna make the job harder. But don't you worry, cause I'm Dax and Daxter. I do the job the right way. Maybe not the best way, but the right way. Why? Nice. I'm hearing some jams right now. No Bluetooth, no. No headphones required. None of that. Just some jams in my head. Like that. Give you the exit door. I don't need it. So where the gas at? Hair conditioner. Nice. <gasps> Disgusting. I'm on a diet. Well, I'll be honest, it's a bulking diet. So I'm not. I mean, still, it's not a dirty bulk, so. Can't be. Can't be hitting them chocolatinos. You get know what I mean? So, where the lighter fluid at? I'm not pulling out no bodies with no with no light. You know I'm not gonna do that. Nobody's gonna do that. Nobody would do that. Come on. No one. No one would do that. It would be it would be very stupid. It would be very unwise too. You know, fuck it. I will. Well, because I'm not scared. Obviously. The hell you think, man. I'm simply not capable of getting scared. When you guys get scared, I feel like scratching my body. That's my reaction to, to fear. So I'm thinking... I really don't know which one. Oh, it has lights. Of course it does, I'm so autistic. Anyway. B8. Oh, which one is B8? The ones down here are B, alright. B7, so this one is B8. It's there. B11. That one is just not showing the number. Here it is. I don't... I don't see it. Yeah, there's no body in there. That's a B, right? That was a B. B11. There's no body in B11. What is this? Why did the sound stop? Don't su don't stop, bro. Stay with me. Stay with me. Here's B11. Of course B11 is there. The one that's not going to be there is probably going to be the last one or this one. B13 probably. No. B11. B12. So B13 is either not there 
Or the next one is the one that's not gonna be. Damn, he's fat. He's standing. Or he's either very. He's either American, or he's standing up. You know, in a different position. So yeah, get ready for the jump scare. I'm not the type of man to get scared by jump scares, but uh, I'm gonna be ready for it anyway. You know, I don't like them. I think they're not cool. Of course, it's not there. <laughs> what? Fucking hell! Body is missing from the freezer. Come on, you know Tommy is a cannibal. The office phone to report this immediately. Do you know? You know Tommy likes some bodies. Especially if it's one of a woman. You know, extra sauce. Extra juice, I guess. Is that, that's just Tommy, man. Is this how he is? Respect him, please. 2023. Should be respecting everyone. Just even if they do whatever they do. So let's go back. Let's pick up the phone and tell them that Tommy ate a body. Our co-worker. Hello? Yeah, Tommy just uh, took a body for lunch. Even though we asked him not to do it again. Apparently my character doesn't like anyone else breathing near him. I think she should be the only one breathing. No one else deserves to be breathing. He thinks he's being real funny, but I don't. Who the fuck was on that? Hearing a camera shutter clicking away, but where's it coming from? <laughs> Who the fuck was on that line? I can't deal with this bullshit right now. Phone line is dead, and this shift is getting very strange. I'm hearing unfamiliar sounds coming from the far side of the morgue. My body is missing. A strange object just appear out of nowhere. But I'm sure there's a logical explanation. Time to investigate where these noises are coming from. No, this is time to go home, man. Go home, get yourself a little, uh, little coffee, little coffee, and chill. It's that simple. Do you you want to you want to act all tough and shit? I gotta know where these noises are coming from, man. I don't play, man. All right, bro. You do you. Alright, I'm gonna have to stop this here because this is already stretching out a bit as it is. So I might just um, leave it for the next uh, for the next video maybe. Make another part. I'll stop playing now. And uh, well, I mean, I'm I'm actually doing this while editing. You're hearing me now while editing. But um, I'm gonna continue the game the next time, like in the next video, because it's getting a bit too long. So uh, yeah. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you liked it. If you did, well, you know what to do. Um, have a great day or night.